it's gorgeous outside so we're gonna go and start a wonderful day in New Orleans with first of all brunch Hi Alex, thanks for helping. We're at Brennan's. They're known for their swanky, glamorous breakfast. I mean, check this decor. And they even have a terrace, but apparently it's gonna be way hot. Turtle soup? Oh, turtle soup. So it's actually made of turtle. Barbecue lobster for me. Um, you know when you bit your side cheek. cheek? It's very good. It's like buttery with a little bit of a citrus in it. Mm. Congratulations, Alex! We got some cotton candy up here. Oh wow! Hey, congratulations! Massive cotton candy! <laughs> This is gonna get really hot. I can feel it already. <laughs> Lots of records. So we're in this record store, um, and guess who I found? An undefeated heavyweight champion. We got to do better. We live from Peaches Records. You already know it's going down like four flat tires in here. Please believe me. Respect. Where y'all from, from in uh, Canada? That was a fantastic tour. Thank you, Jane. Um, we're gonna walk this way until we hit some sort of ice cream store. I see people. I think we're getting close. Oh, it's not that bad. why this place is a big deal is Henson, back in the day, Mr. Henson, patented one of the first um, ice shaving machine and then his wife started making these unique concoction of syrups to go on the ice. Syrup. Syrup. What did I say? Syrup. Oh, syrup. Years, years later, their granddaughter continued uh, working this business and recently won a James Beard Award that recognizes their localness and quirkiness and awesomeness. Nice lips, Alex. Uh, nice marshmallow eating. Right, thank you. And that's where we're going, if I'm not mistaken. And conveniently, only like three minutes away from the hotel. That's right. Whew. Well, I'm ready for dinner. And I'm very excited because we are at Josephine Estelle. The name Josephine Estelle comes from each of the daughter of the two chefs behind the restaurant, which let's not forget to mention are um, James Beard nominated chefs. Woo. I guess uh, this is the second James Beard related thing that we're going to today, New Orleans. Amazing food scene. And this is supposed to be Italian with a southern touch type of cuisine. Correct. Oh. I got the seal of approval. I know what. She's correct on that. Southern food, kind of presentation. <laughs> oh yeah. Are we supposed to hear it? Yeah. These are so big. New Orleans 
specialty where they do oyster, charcoal oyster. So they put it on the uh, fire and they put a little parm cheese on top of it and it's just delicious. Just cooking in the juice of the oyster. And I'm just getting as much cheese out of this shell as I can. Thanks again, y'all. Thanks a ton. That was great, though. Thank you. How about you? Ah, that was so good. That was so long. So, uh, there was a bit of an expected situation. So, we had to go home, but don't worry. We brought the food back with us. So, you can see the delicious pastas. You sure you don't want to share? Yeah, let's share. Let's share. For all of you ladies out there, if you're looking for a Instagram husband, perfect candidate. It's like perfectly al dente. This was fitting. I'm not done yet. See you tomorrow morning. What are we doing now? Oh.